But now there's something else we need to understand. And the next thing is something called a, a benefit. Okay? Now, a benefit is how one experiences the feature. Are you with me on that? Right. So let's say, for example, you mentioned that it was multicolored, right? So what would be a benefit of it being multicolored? Um, it can go anywhere in your home. Very good. Okay. So it's multicolored, goes anywhere in your home. Uh, another thing you said it was it had two pieces of wood. What would the benefit for that be? Two pieces of wood. Um, it can hold more than one thing or do more than one thing at the same time. All right. Outstanding. All right. So it can do more than one thing. It has a red clothespin at the very top. What would be a benefit of red clothespin? That's a benefit. What about the bumblebee at the very top? Um, it's stylish. There we go. Benefit. Now, <clears throat> if we go feature and benefit, for example, feature, it's multicolored. Match everything in the house. That's nice. Red clothespin. Holds a lot of stuff. That's okay. But we need to put everything together. So we have one more part called a bridge. Now, a bridge is how we connect the two together. All right? But now, in the bridge, the bridge connects the feature with the benefit, and it contains the word you. Now, when we use product knowledge and, we, and we're selling something, we always want to explain to the person we're talking in terms of their interests and our, not our own. Does that make sense? Right. All right, so let's say, for example, let's put the whole thing together now, right? Now, a bridge. Uh, an example of a bridge would be like, this means to you, all right? This is important to you. Um, uh, you will love this. All right? So now, let's put it together for you. Are you ready? All right, so first off, give me the feature. Give me a feature. Um, it's multicolored. Multicolored. Good. Give me a bridge. And this is beneficial to you. Good. Give me a benefit. Because it'll go anywhere in your home. Outstanding. Now, let me do it for you. It has a red clothespin at the very top, which is very important to you because it will hold anything in your house, like notes, uh, papers, earrings, whatever you want that you don't want to forget. And you don't want to get that, do you? You see? All right, your turn. Ready? Do it again. Okay. It has two pieces of wood. Two pieces of wood. And this is beneficial to you because it can do multiple things, such as a book holder or maybe a paperweight. Oh, outstanding. See, now you're talking like a sales professional, right. which means that if we are a professional in selling, we want to make sure that we always use product knowledge. But in order to communicate product knowledge, we have to use something called a feature, a bridge, and a benefit. All right? Now, one last thing. Whenever we use product knowledge, you don't have to give them every feature out there. Only the ones that are most important to that person you're talking to. And always talk in terms of, guess who? Their interests. Does that make sense? Right. Well, I want to tell you how much I appreciate you coming today and talking to me about selling. But selling is really, it's really, it's really art. And if you do what you talk about today, I believe that you'll be successful in selling. So always use a feature, a bridge, and a... Benefit. That's right, benefit. Thank you so much. Appreciate it.